Welcome Cancerians to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of February 1st to the 15th of 2021. As I was getting into the can Cancerian energy, I really, uh, as I'm doing this, I'm lighting some sage because I do feel that many of you Cancerians are extremely intuitive, of course, you're a water sign, um, dreamer, uh, a gift of the knowing, psychic ability, whatever you would like to call it. How about you're some of those people that attract ghosts? <laughs> you have that vibration, so you attract energies. So you make sure you clear your energies every so often to only keep the positive energies. And then um, make sure you keep your energies clear so the information that's coming through to the Cancerian is uh, of the highest frequency. I also feel that during this particular time, you're going to notice um, major changes in the relationship with your children. So for some of you Cancerians that have adult children or younger children, um, children, your relationship is going to change. So you need to look at it now from a different perspective, a different situation. You need to really pray about this and see the truth in the situation and then relate to it such as in a good positive way. I feel that there needs to be, there may be a change with the cancer and where they're living. I might have said this to you before because I'm feeling this so strongly. Who's living with you, cancer? Um, and it's definitely matters of the heart and feminine. So for, you know, and I do feel like this could be more than one person. This could be three persons. I know that whatever, if this resonate with, I understand this will not resonate with all you, but it does resonate with some of you. I appreciate the like shares, um, the comments, kind comments, but I feel that this could even be a friendship, not really a relative, but it's going to, uh, there's going to be a new beginning starting here for the Cancerian. I feel that this is going to um, help you financially as well. So there's a financial benefit, definitely a financial benefit uh, from this relationship, this relating, dating. And I feel that you're really gonna review where you're at in this relationship and where it should really, really go. I feel that you're gonna be remove, you're gonna be removing. You're gonna be moving in a new direction in this relationship. So um, again, you wanna keep your energies clean and clear. Because I feel that through this change, you're going, going to be getting some good news. And it's going to be favorable to where it's going to be, uh, it's going to be healthy. It's going to be, uh, you got that position in this company. Or if you started your own company, you got this contract. <laughs> so this is really, really good news. And it does affect matters of the heart because now you're able to let some things go. Now, as soon as I said matters of the heart, why did I hear the word debt? Debt. That sounds so financial, but I'm just going to leave it there for you. You figure it out if this resonates with you. Strong feminine energy. And you may be the female here uh, or you may be the man. Either way, there's a lot of feminine energy and it could be within yourselves that you're honoring this. Which of the Cancerians need to know as they're listening to this video pertaining to love, romance, relationship. Love, romance, relationship. February 1st to the 15th of 2021. Here we go. Here you go. You're gonna meet 
or you're already in this situation where it's balanced. It's balancing for you. There's a renewal in this re in this relationship. Love or romance relationship. Cancer. Yeah. Things are happening fast. But I feel as if you already recognized it and you knew it was occurring. You're feeling safe. It's feeling repaired. So it's as if this has been a relationship and now it's repaired. And you're feeling pretty secure in it. And here's this new beginning. So there's this new beginning here for you, Cancerians. Oh, bottom of the deck, the heart. So this is definitely romance or deeply matters of the heart. Yeah. Here we go, Pisces, pot of gold, and nesting at home. Okay, I'm gonna pick these cards back up and shuffle them very well. Cancer, career, finance, cancer. So in, in uh, love relationship, there's a renewal of some kind of good energy. Career, finance, cancer. February 1st to the 15th, here we go. Fast changes once again. Career, finance, cancer. Mm. Okay, we had a couple cards that dropped. Hmm. These are the career and finance. These two fell out of the deck. There's something that you do not yet know. It's a mystery, career and finance. And it truly is the key of what is to be. And this is what you're going to see during this time. Now, remember what I said about clearing out your energies. Just, you know. Cancer. Love, romance, relationship. We know what's happening there. Things are gonna be, uh, re a renewal is gonna be taking place. Um, it's going to be uh, a time to, you know, reevaluate where you've been and where you would like to go and how this person fits into your life. Um, I feel children are very strong. Either you're gonna have children, uh, this is a prayer that a truth is gonna be revealed. Oh, this is, you know, you're gonna have a lot of mysteries revealed during this particular time. Um, and then as car, far as career and finance, I feel that it, some, it strongly involves the home and I do see um, money coming in, I feel that this money is going to be linked to this mystery that's going to be revealed. And somehow there's a friend. So did a friend give you a heads up on some things? Um, I, it somehow involves relationships here for you, but it turns out in your favor, Cancerians. I, I mean, you know that it does. And again, you're dreaming. Maybe you, you, are you dreaming of a Pisces? Do you, you know, you need to pay attention to your dreaming. And there's your pot of gold. So uh, there seems to be a lot of um, retrieving what you thought you had lost, whether this is from a past relationship, that's that renewal, or this could also be for, um, which is in relationship with your finance. 
finally feeling your worth again. Yeah. And that's something that you're continually, that's a battle for you. That's a battle, it's like a cycle. But uh, remember, I really feel that during this particular time, there is a, a sense of, uh, of reward as being a family person, um, honored by your children in some manner, and some situations you just need to leave up to the divine. So with that, please, if this resonated with you, click like, share, and subscribe. I realize how important that is. Kind comments. I read every comment, so I hope you leave a kind one. Private reading, patrellasintuitiveinsights.com. Leave it in the link below. I also started a new YouTube channel. It's called Angels, Ancestors, and Energies. It's also in the link below. It has uh, just topics that, as I do my reading and, and getting to know so many of you, I realize that you have your own paranormal stories. So one of our episode, episodes are, um, you know, when dreams become real. And I, you know... We're going to further that. So just check us out. With that, God bless you, Cancerians. <laughs>